What up, y'all? It's your man, Patience. And listen, I'm going to definitely need you guys to hold my mule on this one. All right, y'all. Ty Tribbett. Now, I'm not going to say a lot on this video because I want you guys to hear it directly from him, what it's like to be in the gospel music industry. He says out of his own mouth, it is not an industry that was created to glorify God, although God can be glorified in it. But I just want to take this time to say, guys, go ahead, hit the subscribe button right now if you're listening. Also hit the notification bell so you guys can keep up with everything that I'm posting on this channel. And I want you guys to go ahead and listen to Ty Tribbett. Listen. Up. You know, I just got off the phone, my business call, and I was just talking the air out a little bit. I'm just, I got a single coming out. Well, I want to put a single out that I'm like very, very excited about. I've been off the music scene for a little while. I feel like I've been off the music scene for a little while, and partially for, for, for reasons like this. Uh, so I've been off the music scene for a little bit now. I'm excited to kind of come back and give this single. I'm excited about this song. I feel like it fits the times. I feel like it's encouraging and inspiring and uplifting. And I want to make, not make y'all, but help y'all dance a little bit through this pandemic. Uh, bring a little joy in your homes. Bring a little dance and uh, an encouraging word. That was the purpose of it. Uh, I use whatever resources I had. I don't got my band here. I don't got my singers here. So I just, you know, uh, the sound is what it is. It's kind of like work it out type thing. But I just got off the call with, with, with um, you know, a business call. And, it, and it's like, I'm not selling out, y'all. I'm sorry. It's like, yo, your song is hot. Da -da -da -da. If you do this. We can get you. I was like, yo, man. I was like, nah. I literally just hung up on the call. I literally like, hey, y'all. I can't do this right now. I know it's it's really all about the money. And I, I ain't selling out like that, yo. So uh, uh, I'm out. What I mean all about the money is, like, if you got money, you can get certain platforms. Period. Um... If not, you gotta do certain things to get that platform and make certain compromises. I don't got the money other people got. Well, let's just say I'm not willing <laughs> to use the money I got for that. That's what I mean by I'm not selling out. I ain't doing that. Nope, I'll pay my bills with my money. I'll, 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 I'll help the church and the people. No, I'm not that ambitious. I don't need it that bad. The song is going to come out. It's going to do what it's going to do. But I, I can't compromise, man. I can't sell out. I just can't believe. I can't believe I'm, I'm This is why I don't. This is why my head was in the sands of Orlando and lived church. Like, I can't. The industry, I can't. I can't do it. It's not godly. God didn't establish, establish the music industry. He didn't establish the gospel music industry. It's an industry. It's just, and to, to, to make music and to use the gift God gave you and to put all your blood, sweat, and tears. I know I sound like every other artist, but you put your blood, sweat, and tears into it. You put excellence into it. You, you know what I mean? The Lord gives you a gift and you want to give it back to him and point it back to him. And then you got to place this baby called a song into the hands of a godless industry. It's like, yo, and I'm not just talking mainstream. I mean, even the gospel music industry is, is not God established. Though he is glorified, he didn't establish it. Just like he might not have established your job, but you, he can get glory at your place of work. It's the same thing. But to put, to put these songs into the hands of that, and if you guys hear, whether you hear it or not, it's based on these powers that be or what, I don't know. I'm just rambling. I know I'm frustrated, but. What's up, homie? You good? You good? My bad. My bad. Y'all right. um, getting it done, bro? Yeah. All right. I'm, I'm happy about that. I'm excited about the single, y'all. I just want y'all to dance and be encouraged. I don't care if it's like a TikTok thing. I don't, I don't care about what the world considers success anymore. I will just be on this level for the rest of my life. And others that are willing to do what it takes to get there, they'll be the ones that go up. And that's not everybody. Some people do got pure hearts and some people do got 
like, yo, that type of favor from God where they excel without having to compromise. I have been one that have been able to excel without compromising to this level. And the other levels that you get, like the big, what people would consider big things or why gospel music is here and it seems like mainstream music is there. I'm not willing to do it. I'm not willing to do it. So if I'm going to stay on this level for the rest of my life, let me recline. I'm not doing it. If my music is not good enough to be placed certain places, hallelujah. Maybe it's not for that. I do it to the glory of the Lord and I do it to encourage and inspire people. Everybody wants what? Everybody wants success, even what the world considers success. Everybody knowing your name, everybody knowing your song, everybody enjoying your music. Um, yeah, that's, 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 everybody will want that. If you write music and make music, you want every, as much ears as possible to hear it and enjoy it. Uh, but I, I'm just realizing it's not the reality all the time. You know what I mean? And of course, everybody's not going to know everybody. Anyway, I, 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 I'm not doing it, y'all. I'm not selling out. I, I, I can't do it. If you do this, then it could get played. Is the song good or not? If you do it, do you like the song or not? If you, if you, do people like the song? Let them hear it first before you make me adjust. Like, yo, if you do this, Ty, if you, if you be this, if you, nah, no, 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 no. I'm not doing it. Nope. But if I had the money, I could pay for that platform. But I'm good on that. Well, I'm, I'm going to stop saying if I had the money. Thank God I got a couple of pennies. But if I had the money for that, I'm not using my money for that. That's what I'm saying. Not doing it. I'm not doing it, y'all. And y'all pray for people, man. I mean, it's a, it's a crazy dance. It's a crazy dance to hold on to your integrity, to hold on to your convictions, and then to be in this world but not of it. It's a challenge to not be of it. It depends on how ambitious you are. It depends on how how much you desire it. Nah, I don't desire it that bad. I'm good. I don't desire it that bad. If I desire anything, it's for people to know the song and hear it and to enjoy it and be encouraged by it and their hearts turn to God from it. Period. Period. So, and it ain't about money to me. It ain't about making the money to me. <clears throat> Sick of that, too. I do anything for my man, please. If you really knew, you tuck your tail as well. But I, I, I just got frustrated. I just hung up that call and was like, uh, no, they still on there talking right now, y'all. I was like, nah, I'm out. Y'all got that. I'm not selling out. I'm not doing that. And people know, artists know what I'm talking about. Labels know what I'm talking about. Uh, PR, everybody who's in the industry know what I'm talking about. And I'm not hating on nobody. I'm just not willing to do certain things. That's all. So... I love y'all. Enjoy it. I don't know how long I'm going to be in this music industry. If it continues, uh, not if it continues, it's, it's built on what it's built on. I don't know. I got to find another way to move. I got to find another way to do it. Um, I thank God for new godly partnerships like TBN uh, and things of that nature. But mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. I'm going to be wise as a serpent because I'm in this world and I'm not of it. And I'm going to use bait. To be fishers of men, you got to understand bait. You got to understand that. I don't know no fisher man that eats their bait. We don't like it. We don't like worms. That's for who we trying to catch. That ain't for us. So I understand that too. I understand uh, that level of compromise where I will give you a little bit of what you are accustomed to just to hook you and get you onto my boat. I understand that. I believe my sound is the bait. Like when you hear the sound of this new song, that's as far as I'm a straight, <laughs> as far as bait, uh, the sound, how it feels is like, whoa. And then hopefully if you get hooked or not, that's, that's the bait I'm using. So, you know, I understand that bait is not something that we, you know, enjoy ourselves completely, <laughs> but we use that to catch those who do, um, but not, nah, not to that degree, not to the degree I was offered today. The offer I was made today, I still, I, I, I was just like, nah. And it kept coming back like, well, what? nah. Well, no, 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 nah. That's like demonic, yo. Then it still came back like, well, well, I'm like, nah. How you gonna come back after I say it's demonic? But anyway, 
I guess you can ask, well, who is you talking to? The industry. So, I don't know. We're in a pandemic and I'm talking about this. I'm sorry, y'all. I'm just trying to get music to y'all while we're in this. I'm trying to get encouragement to y'all. I'm trying to help y'all dance and um, praise the Lord and be encouraged at the same time. And it's so challenging. Then you be like, where this artist at? They ain't put out music in so long. Where this guy at? Where, man, stuff like this. Doing this dance with these people, man. Doing, doing like, how much are you willing to come? How much are you? I'm not doing it. So I might, I might be on the next unsung or where where are they now? Not because I ain't got nothing, but because I'm not willing to do everything. Period. All right, I love y'all. This rant is like borderline unnecessary, but I pray everybody's well in this pandemic. That's more important. Uh, pray everybody's healthy and safe. Prayerfully we'll be out of this soon. Uh, I'm praying for everyone who lost loved ones, man. It's ridiculous. That's more important than everything I just said, which is why I want to put this music out. But I love you guys. And uh, just pray. Even in the pandemic, evil is still evil and it ain't bending. It's like, oh, well, this is the key to get in these doors. Well, throw that key. I, I don't need the doors. I'm good. God will open doors for me. And if not, I'm grateful for the doors he's already opened. And I will bless him at all times. His praise will continually be in my mouth, period. I honor him. I love him. I trust him. And it doesn't mean he's not with me because I don't go up the charts. Charts does not reflect God's goodness. No. It don't mean I'm blessed because people know me and you're famous. Fame does not reflect God's mercy or goodness or his favor. No. No. And if that continues to be the determining factor, there are so many people who don't have God's goodness. So that devil is a liar. Anyway, I love y'all. Be safe. Be good. Pray for your bull. Pray for everybody. Pray for everybody. Pray. Intercede. It's praying times. I'm about to go right and pray right now. I should have prayed before I did this rant. But I've had it up to here. You can't hear. Uh-oh, don't sneeze around people. You know, it's a sin to sneeze nowadays. It's a sin to be human or have any interactions with people or cough or <laughs> it's borderline criminal to sneeze now or it's offensive to be out in public without a mask on. <laughs> ah, wow. Hello, 2020. I love y'all. Be safe, be blessed, and I, I'll holler at y'all. I got a single coming out, y'all. I don't know if y'all hear it, but uh, it ain't about my single. I really want to get music to y'all. I already know the song. I already danced over it. My family already loves it. And if that's the purpose of it, thank you, Lord, for the ability to make music that my house can enjoy. Uh, but I do want a few other people to hear it as well. So I love y'all, man. Uh, yeah, we'll talk soon. Prayerfully, y'all hear this music, and it'll bless you in your house. Until then, live.